Welcome to the monthly Maritime and Coast Guard Agency video news podcast, bringing you the latest stories from around the UK's coasts. In this edition, Ensign, the MCA's large yacht division at the Fort Lauderdale International Boat Show, and the S-92, the latest helicopter to come into service for HM Coast Guard. The Maritime and Coast Guard Agency's Large Yacht Division, Ensign, was in Florida in October when the team met yacht owners, crew and others involved in this high-value industry at the Fort Lauderdale International Boat Show. Ensign, the MCA's Large Yacht Division for yachts over 24 metres, provides an exclusive service to the growing worldwide large yacht industry. The code has generally been adopted as the international industry standard. Any new build boats should be done to the MCA code. We have a better, safer boat because of it. The galley is enclosed in steel, the fire separation zones, um, although she was built with what they had watertight doors. I'm now running a, a brand new, well, a two-year-old yacht, uh, Amels build, um, built to code. Uh, that's the difference. Now I can go around, I haven't been in the initial stages, but I'm familiar with it, having run through it on Talitha and I now a run a boat that I know is, is inherently safe. And there's recently been an upsurge in inquiries relating to helideck operations on board such yachts. Ensign provides a worldwide standard and a worldwide service for large yachts regardless of flag. The first of four new Sikorsky S-92 search and rescue helicopters recently entered service with the Maritime and Coast Guard Agency. It will be based in Stornoway, providing cover for the Western Isles. The S-92s are faster and with greater range than their predecessors. They also have a flexible interior that can be fitted with two auxiliary fuel tanks to increase their range, or with seating for up to 19 passengers or for stretcher cases. This flexibility is very important for the multiple roles the aircraft has to play within the Scottish island communities. Each S-92 will have state-of-the-art search and rescue equipment, including the Automatic Identification System, AIS, and forward-looking infrared for use at night and in low light. They also come equipped with dual rescue winches and auto-hover to enhance rescue operations. With the S-92s and their enhanced features, the MCA can continue to provide valuable search and rescue coverage around the UK's coasts. We'll bring you more as other S-92s enter service. That's in future editions of the MCA Monthly Video News Podcast. <laughs>